The only prom that I really remember is the Doctor Who prom. And I think that was my first prom. I don't, I don't know, when was that, Tessa? Was it way back in, I mean, it was probably 2000 and something. I think that must have been in 2010. No, 2010. Because I remember, oh, 2008, you did that one. So I remember coming to watch watch you before I came back um, to join the choir I came to watch it and it was the first LPC concert I'd seen that had my dad in it I mean, and uh, <laughs> it was pretty spectacular yeah I mean I, I remember that not not obviously not for the music but for the sheer occasion and the fact that there were so many kids there you know this is this is this is live music for kids which is you know where where we're all coming from you know, I mean, we've spent our lives, me, you know, probably a lot longer than you, you know, I'm, you know, knocking on 74 this year. So, <laughs> uh, and and it, it was just a lovely occasion, I mean, a lovely occasion. The only other prom that I really remember was my first Verdi Requiem. The rest of them, well, I, I can't, honestly can't really remember proms. <laughs> I think I think that says more about your memory. Uh, yeah. Well, when we did when we did Verdi Requiem, um, it was actually my first Verdi as well, and everyone was pretty surprised because I've sung in choirs all my life. Like, how could that possibly be my first Verdi Requiem? But it was, and it was pretty spectacular. Um, not just because um, Sarah Connolly came in at the last minute. Um, as, as a soloist and she didn't actually have an opportunity to rehearse with us at all um, apart from with the conductor Andres Orozco um, Estrada but then just came and did the gig just like that um, so that was pretty on the edge of your seat um, experience and yeah it was a, it was a pretty spectacular first Verdi Requiem for me so I'll, I'll remember that one <laughs> 